Hi, friends. Have you ever seen any dragon boat races? Yes. That's one of the popular activities in the Dragon Boat Festival in China. The Dragon Boat Festival, also called Dan Wu Jie in China, is another important traditional festival of the Chinese people. It falls on the fifth day of the fifth month in the Chinese lunar calendar. The Dragon Boat Festival originated from the primitive sacrificial ceremonies to propitiate the dragon, the river god. In ancient China, most people lived by the river. It was believed that the rivers were controlled by dragons, who also determined the distribution of rainwater for farming and human life. Sacrifices were therefore offered to the Dragon King on some day in the fifth lunar month, just before the rainy season came in the following month. In so doing, people hoped that they would be favored with timely rainfall and be exempt from flood and drought. Later, this festival was associated with Chu Yuan, the great patriotic poet and statesman of the Warring States period, and gradually became a festival in commemoration of him. Chu Yuan was an official of the state of Chu and served King Huai as his advisor for a period of time. Realizing the menace of aggression by the state of Qin, he insisted on an anti-Qin alliance with other smaller states, but was opposed by other important ministers of the imperial court. Because of his strong advocacy of resistance against Qin, he was slandered by treacherous court officials and was exiled from in the capital of Chu in 286 BC. Sorted in his ambition to save his motherland, he expressed his ardent love for his country and deep sympathy for his people in many outstanding poems written in his wandering life in the vicinity of the Dongting Lake and the Milo River in present-day Hunan province. In the year 278 BC, on hearing that the Qing army had captured the capital of his country, he threw himself into the Milo River in grief and despair on the fifth day of the fifth lunar month. When local people heard of his death, some beat guns and drums on banks to scare fishing dragons away from his body. Some rode out to the spot to search for it, but in vain. In order to protect Chu Yuan's dead body from being eaten by the river dragons and fish, people threw zhongzi, sticky rice dumplings wrapped in bamboo and reed leaves into the river to feed them. It was from these that derived the customs of holding dragon boat races and eating zongzi on the day of the festival.